Hey guys, this is Ryan from iPod Tech Help, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make your own custom theme. This thing, this video will be in four parts. There will be a video every day of the week for this week, the week of um, December 7th, 2009. So there will be a video up today, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So be looking forward to that. It'll be a whole little series. So today we're going to cover the we're going to cover the wallpaper and the lock background. I do have the dimensions for this and the dimensions that are listed in every video will be put in the sidebar. Um, tomorrow we will be going to go into our editing software which I use Adobe Photoshop CS3. Uh, you can use whatever I just use CS, CS2 actually because this is the version that I have this is what I have. I went and got this. So we're gonna do file, new, and I'm gonna bring this down for everybody to see. Background. We're gonna do the. I mean, we're gonna do the wallpaper. So it's gonna be 320 by 375. So that's pixels. Everything's in pixels. So we'll bring this back up because I have now forgotten it. Because I'm like that. Wow. And I must have minimized it. Let me go find it again. Sorry, guys. Uh. I don't know these off the... 320 by 375, okay. File new. Bah. 375. And there we go. Now you have your wallpaper. And double click on it. Background layer, make sure it's set to whatever. And I'm going to drag and drop... Uh, which picture should I use? If I can get my picture. And I think I'm going to use use the one that's already labeled wallpaper. Put that in there. Double click. I'm going to minimize this. As you can see, it's there. Double click on it. Do it that way. I'm going to take the magic background eraser tool. And we're going to erase the background. I'm going to see if I can get some of this in there. Yeah, get some of the shadow off because... Shadow doesn't look very good unless it's in the right background. And I'm just gonna touch it up a little. Okay, and then we're gonna click that and drag and drop into here. And there you go. And I'm not sure, I'm trying to find a good balance between boards. I am not a skater, guys. Don't be saying, you're not, you know, skater. I know I know skater. I hate prep. <laughs> joke. I might be. That's what you guys want to call me. You can call me that, but uh, this is just going to be simple, guys. I'm not going to try and do anything fancy. Stretch it out. Try and get it perfect, and then I'm going to go to layer one. First, I got to click on that and get the layer. I'm just going to keep it like that. And I'm just going to do file, save as. Here's an important part, guys. I'm going to make sure you save it as W-A-L-L-P-A-P-E-R and this is the this is the part that some people do mess up on dot PNG save and click OK and then we're going to get minimize this exit out of this yes cancel exit no because I'm going to throw this away after we're done so we'll not be using this thing. And then we're going to do File, New, bring this up, and we're going to do the lock background, which is 320 by 480. So 320 by 480. And there we go. And we're going to drag and drop this. And that was not a very good picture. Too small of a picture, in my opinion. I think I might have screwed up on that part. And we're just going to exit out of you. And no... Boom, ba boom, double click. There we go. Uh, this will probably be a short video, guys. I'm trying to space these videos out to where they're pretty decently even, even out so that I can somewhat get my videos in there. I think I'm just going to fill this up with the text. Yeah, I'm just going to fill this up with the text. I guess I can show you guys. Yeah, I'm going to show you guys how to do a starburst also starburst effect 
Might as well. Simple. So, yeah. I'm just going to show you guys how to do a quick Star Wars effect. So, let's go to nice... Found a nice gray. Looks pretty beast. Yes, I guys, I do use beast a lot. It is my word. For time now. Just going to go up. And that gray does not look great. Okay, I'm just going to change this to black. Better yet, that nice dark blue. That looks... Yep, that looks pretty good. And we're just going to hit filter. And then we're going to hit distort. And then we're going to hit wave. And I have it as sign. You can use either one. It really does not matter. I think I'm going to use square this time. Then I'm going to do filter, distort, and then we're going to do polar coordinates, guys. And I always like to zoom out, see what it looks like. That does look pretty beast. So I will be taking this and using this. Because this is pretty cool. And all you're going to want to do is make sure that layer is unclicked. And then we're just going to do this. And we're going to take it. And that really does mess it up somewhat. I have no idea. Um, and then we're just going to put that on top layer that on top layer delete layer yes and that looks pretty cool we got a nice starburst effect kinda coming at you the boards did get a little bit messed up but oh well they're boards we'll be fine uh... delete layer yes and you're just gonna file save as L O C K guys background b a k c k G R O U N D dot P N G mixer. I'm just gonna make sure because I always mess this up when I try and do this. Dot P N G and I'm gonna click OK. And now you have a nice background. You have a nice lock background and a background. Uh, documents no exit no. Exit. No. Okay. So, that's it. This will be in the description for lock background and wallpaper. So, look forward to that. Um, also, go check out my website, iPodTechHelp.webs.com. If you guys help me get a close to about 100 or so views, I'll put it to a .com address, hopefully. Go check out my Twitter. Um, uh, Twitter.com slash iPodTechHelp. I am tech is my logo. Um, also guys, go check out, um, this is a really cool dude, his name is, let's see if I can get him, Top Touch 5, if I'm correct, is that him? Yeah, that's him. Guys, go check out Top Touch 5, he's a pretty cool dude, he's got some good app reviews going, he's got some app reviews, he's got a DJ headset review. He's got some unboxings. Um, he's he's really good at app reviews, guys. He's got some good stuff going there. If you guys would go check him out, he's pretty beast. Um, oops, yeah. Oh well, no information set there. Um, look forward to a giveaway and an unboxing, guys. I will be getting a two things from a company, which you guys probably already saw if you would play close attention. Um, yeah, just go check out my, my website, my Twitter, and go check out Top Touch 5's, uh, channel. Link will be in an annotation to the left. I'll put an annotation here, 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 and here. Go check him out. He's a pretty cool dude. He's got some cool stuff going on. Guys, this is Ryan from iPod Tech Help, signing out. Peace. Okay, guys, one more thing. If you're gonna, um, put this into the theme, you're gonna have to do this. You're gonna have to go... Right click on your desktop, click new, click folder, name it whatever you want. We're going to do skate, border, I'm going to do skateboard, T-H-E-M-E. Um, pretty simple. Drag and drop. These will not have to be put in any anything. Uh, these are pretty, I do like, this is simple stuff, guys. Just got to listen, you got to look. Um, next. Next, I will be covering um, icons and dock, so stay tuned for that, guys.